This is Arden again on the Arden Show, and today I am going to be showing you how to make an NES Classic using a Raspberry Pi. Thank you, but not this kind of Raspberry Pi. Arden. Sorry, but using this kind of Raspberry Pi. I know NES classics are hard to find, so I am going to show you how to make a gaming system using a clone from China. Now here are the four main things you will need. You will need a clone from China, and you will also need a Raspberry Pi 3, a micro SD card with 32 gigs or more, and a USB controller. For everything else you will need, please see the description below. Now here is how you will make it. Step number one. Open your clone using a screwdriver and take out the guts. Then I'm gonna take the guts out. Yeah. <laughs> Step number two. So, you will want to shave off all the pins and components so your Raspberry Pi fits nicely inside here. Voila. Step number three, replace these ports with two of these ports. Step number four, get your pins for this one. Solder the buttons and the components to the Pi. Step number five, cut open the top and insert an SD card reader. Step number six, put everything back together and insert RetroPie. Step number seven, grab your game system and let's get retro. Here we go. Hello! Goodbye! Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and let me know in the comment down below if this is the coolest one I've ever done. Thank you for watching. Bye!